Hi everyone. Hello again. So nice to see you on the channel today. Yes. And today we're going to show you some improvements in our farm attic room. Yes. It's far from being finished, as you can see behind us. Yeah, it will take some time. Yes. We thought it would be great to, well, sort of show you the journey of yes. this room. And we bought some bits and bobs that you might like. And the cupboards will probably go in next month. The joiner is so busy and but we, we, we said we don't mind the way no. because he seems to be popular and that's a good thing. Yeah. And yeah, so let's share what's new in here. Now the first thing we want to show you, some of you might remember the lampshade that we have made from a beautiful loose and wood fabric yeah. and we showed them the lampshade a couple of videos ago. But now we also have a beautiful floor lamp and we got that one from Pookie Lights and also we got some new chairs up here and it's still wrapped and we thought it would be great to unwrap them with you. This is a Napoleon III slipper chair. Yeah. It's from the 19th century. We actually have two, but we just brought one up here because yeah. they need to be reupholstered. You will see in a second why. Yeah, because we guess a minimum 150 years old. Yeah, they are quite old. And actually, these two chairs have the perfect size because we could easily bring them up here because, as you know, the staircase, the upper staircase, is quite narrow. And, yeah, this wasn't... a a problem at all. And we also want to show you this, which is an Egyptian table that yeah. Jörg got from my parents many years ago yeah. for his birthday. So we haven't bought it, it's just a wonderful memory. So this is dark wood and it has a plate in there. And, and it's just wonderful. Yeah. And to be honest with you, at first I thought, hmm, would this really go together? But then, on the other hand, when you see old homes, people always, always style new and old things. And this, we could never get rid of this. No. Never, ever. So, yeah, that's up here. And do you want to show the box first, Jack, or...? Should we unwrap that? The box? Unwrap that. Unwrap the chair. Yes. Great. Yes. Hang on. Oh, you don't need the scissors. I thought you need them. So they are not in the best condition because they are old and yeah. Lots of wrapping. Yeah, it's kind yeah. Of... Yeah, can you still? Oh, oh. Yeah, because it's stuck. Like... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can, I mean, you can also see here its condition. So it's quite delicate, you have to be so careful. But we fell in love with them, and they are just the perfect size for this room. Since we, since we can't have an armchair or a sofa up here. So we can't unwrap it completely because it's simply too delicate. And yeah, I got in touch with an upholsterer yesterday and we will probably have them upholstered next month. And you can see, you know, actually like the feet yeah. are a perfect match to to yeah. this table the perfect match so you get an idea about the style and we really love it it's gorgeous and we got so many fabric samples as well to choose from yeah 
and I don't know, we will probably, because we will get our very nice Gustavian chair on Saturday, which we will film on the weekend, and it is so, so hard to choose, to be honest with you, so many gorgeous fabrics, but we must say, well, Jörg really fell in love with this one. Yeah, yeah. Yes. you really love this one. And we also love this one as well. And yeah, it's honestly, it's so tough. So many gorgeous fabrics. I actually, I came across this fabric, which is, let me show you again. We seem to have an obsession with Colfax and Fowler, to be yeah. honest. So it's another Colfax and Fowler fabric. So Jörg got me this magazine last week called Homes and Antiques. And this is where we spotted this fabric. So that's that one, which would be probably a little bit too red in here. So this one would be great, but to be honest with you, this is not cheap. No. So, this one is nice as well and a lot cheaper. And we also, we also found this gorgeous fabric, but this is gorgeous as well. Yeah. But it is too thin. So, this is Ian Manking, which is actually a good price point, but... This is too thin. And we also like, we also like this one as well. It's nice as well, do yeah. you think? Yeah. So we will see. It all depends on the costs at the end of the day. And yeah, uh, we'll see. At the moment, we, we tend to go either for this or this one, but we will see. Yeah, and this is actually the first time I got this magazine, and there are some lovely things in there, and a lot about the art of layering print and pattern, which is absolutely perfect. And yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous, at least now in the stage we are here with a house so that's great so the next thing we got is this gorgeous antique box which also has the perfect size in here and we found it via the interior it's gorgeous can you open yeah. it Jörg? wait let me yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It has, it's a bit like some sort of tray. Yes. So, yeah. 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 And you can store some of the, I don't know, computer things or whatever yeah. in here. Stationery. And we really love it. I love the colour. Yeah. It's really nice. It's a very warm brown. Yeah. So we got the two chairs and the box from Venturia, but I want to point out, should you stumble upon something very nice on Venturia, or let's say selling antiques, love antiques, try, if possible, try to find out the, the seller and get in touch with him or her, because then you might be able to pay less. I mean, we never do. Whenever we find something, we always send a message and we never pay the original price. We always ask for less. And as for the chairs, I saw that there were, well, some options of Napoleon III slipper chairs. And then I tried to find their original seller because there was a website and then I got in touch with the seller 
and asked for, well, a cheaper price and they accepted and it's so worth getting in touch with the original seller because Venturia, I mean, they want to make profit. So you might get away with even a better price if you try directly through the seller. So it's really worth checking. Yeah. And the last thing we've got is a new TV. Yes. Yeah. Quite a, a big purchase. Yeah, we decided to get one because it's always good to have a second TV in the house. Yeah, we, we said, like, yeah. if we really want to retreat, yeah. we will come up here. And and it, it's not a sponsor, just to give you a heads up. It's just what we wanted. wanted. So this is the frame from Samsung. And we thought this would look nice up here because you can basically hang it like, like a big picture. Yeah, it's a very thin TV. Yeah. And... You've got a frame and it looks, and when you switch it up, you can you'll be able to, to put a picture on it. Yeah, you can choose some art. Yes, choose some art. And opened it when we got it, but we haven't taken it out yet. No. So we don't really know. And we thought we would hang the TV in this video, if possible. Yeah. So this is where the TV will be on this wall, right above the desk. We think that's a great spot for it. Okay. This is what we got. All the instructions. Wow. Okay. Right. Wow, that's quite heavy. The wall mount. Right. What's that? That's a box where you connect uh, the TV to the electricity and everything. Ah, uh, okay. Because the TV... Yeah. Because it's like a picture of a wall. Yeah. Yeah, you connect it via a cable to this one connect. Right. And then you can connect this to the electricity and to other appliances. Well, we'll see. We'll see, yeah. I'll have to find out. And let me help you with this because it's quite heavy, I think. Hang on. There you go. That's the size of the TV. Okay. What's next? No. Yeah. I'll have to find, I have to look at the wall mount. Mm hmm. Okay, that's the wall mount. Let's see. And I have to get this one, two. It was so sunny this morning, and now it looks like if it's going to rain. So, this is how it will work. Yeah. This will be fixed to the wall, mm -hmm. and this will be fixed to the TV. Yeah. And then, you can put it here. Right. And then it's done. Okay, what you also have to do is to put this into the TV. Yeah, because that's to get the pictures and the electricity to the TV. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because this will be the other end, right. will be attached to this box. Yeah. yeah. Can we? Could we hide this box in our antique box? No, you couldn't. No. Only right. if you would. Punch a hole through it because... Oh, no, no, that's, no. <laughs> that's not happening, of course. No, but right. this will be just on the floor. Right, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. you can still hide it. Yeah, it will be being hidden by the, by the desk. Yeah. Thank you. 
so my task today is filming and Jörg's task is fixing the TV and I'm so tired now I think I need a cup of I need a little bit of energy I'm almost falling asleep and now Jörg is measuring hang on so what I did is I this is a straight line yeah which is exactly horizontal I always I don't know it's probably because we live here now the word German level just makes me makes me smile. But um, did you buy that here? No. No, it's from Germany. It's 20 years old. <laughs> it's old. I had it when we bought our well, when, say, when we built our house in Germany. Yeah. So a while ago, this room looked okay, and now it's a total tip. Best idea of the day. Cup of tea? Yeah. Ah, so looking forward to that in all this chaos. It really looks like chaos. Well, as I said, yeah. like a minute ago, this room was all right, but now a total mess. What? But give me a few minutes and it looks good. Okay. In German, you say, wo geholt wird fallen Späne. Ja, wo geholt wird fallen Späne. I don't know the English translation no. for that. So, two Yorkshire teas with milk. Bliss. Hmm. Sorry, I don't have any biscuits. I also thought I would mention Egypt again. So, my parents lived in Egypt for 10 years and I was with him for three years. I went to the German school in Cairo and my dad had a job there. He had a job offer, which back then totally it was totally unexpected and well he accepted and it was an amazing experience so I made lots of friends from all over the world so did my parents and it it definitely I mentioned it in an old video it made me the person I am today and yeah it was unforgettable what an experience <laughs> This is definitely not Instagram worthy. Like so many people always keep saying everything looks so perfect on Instagram, even in some videos. I'm not talking about us, by the way, uh, in general. But, um, well, whereas in fact, this is the reality. <laughs> So this is the frame itself that we chose. We chose a brown one. It likes it, it looks as if it clicks automatically. Did you see? Have a look here. Yeah. So and jetzt drücke ich ihn ran. Is it done? the result so far yeah and the thing is we can't it's like the same 
downstairs in this nook. We have to have the TV like this. I can't have it any higher because we had a car accident like, oh dear, it's like 29 years ago and since then I've been having neck problems so it has to hang like that. There's no other way. But that's the reason why we chose this one. So we can use it like a picture. Yeah. And for the cable, I don't know if that is the, the correct word. We, we will use some kind of duct and just paint it in the same colour as the wall. So it will basically disappear. So that's the TV. And now you can choose your art and I don't know, you can use your own pictures, Yes. right? Or you can subscribe to, let's say, to get access to different kinds of art. Yeah, and that, it says it costs like 39 yeah, 90 that's, that's what it says. Yeah, this is Four what it's... £4 a month. Yeah. So, and then you just have more access to to all yeah. kinds of yeah. pictures because the TV itself has just one. Yes. And yeah, I don't know. This is just how it is. Yeah. So for the time being, we just use the one that's on there, which is Salt Lake, the Salt Lake in Utah. Yeah. And yeah, but as you can see, it looks it looks very nice. Mm. We will choose something else that yeah. that fits our style. Sure, we all do. Yeah. But great, it took some time. Yes. <laughs> it took some time. But it looks good now. It does. Yeah. Yeah. It looks very nice. I really like it that it's just like, it really hangs like a picture. Yeah. It's not like a TV. Absolutely not. It's great. It's really great. Now that was a very casual vlog. Yeah. We <laughs> hope it's fine. We we really hope we can travel again next month or at least explore some yeah. places so that we can share more on YouTube. But yeah, because I'd say to travel is more fun than mounting a TV. <laughs> Definitely. But we are still in full lockdown and this is all we can do. And yeah. Um, yeah, we sometimes I know some some of you say don't feel bad, uh, but to be honest, we sometimes do because yeah, I don't know. It is what it is, yeah. and yeah. Stay tuned for more videos and yeah. take care of yourself. Yes, take care and see you soon. See you very soon. So until next time. Bye. Bye. Bye bye.